Hey guys, today I will be unboxing Seon's new album, 24. I did get both versions. I believe it's 2 and 4 version, I think so. Like T-O and F-O-R. Yes, so let's go through this one first. I, at first I thought this was like separate, but it's like attached onto the album. A little Polaroid. That's super cute. Looks like he's on a beach. Oh, here's the back. It kind of like connects. He looks so cute basking in the sun. There is the track list if you can read that. And the side is green. Let's get into it. It seems pretty thick. Ooh, let me take my card out. There were a bunch of things that I took out and I kind of have a feeling that his photo cards are going to be the same Polaroid cards he's always been doing ever since he first debuted. I mean, I do like them. They are really cute. Doesn't matter to me. That tone reflects who I really am. I love his music so much. I always truly enjoy every release from him. His music is so like chill and feel good to me. It always puts me in a really good mood. And Say Yes is such a bop. That's the title track. I also really enjoyed the music video because he's just like chilling and he's just vibing in the music video and he looks so sweet and adorable. I mean, he always is. I've always been a huge fan of him ever since Produce 101 Season 2. I've always really liked him. So I've been rooting for him since I first found out about him in 2017 from Produce. So yeah, I'm so glad he's doing so well and he's so cute. Look at him. I actually was not that shocked that he didn't join Gravity because like everyone was maybe thinking that he would be in Starship's next boy group, but I'm not really shocked. He suits a soloist really well. He loves playing his guitar. I think he shines brightly on his own. He doesn't really need to be in a group. His solo music is amazing. I think he's doing very well on his own. Actually, well, he is pretty underrated, so I would definitely recommend checking out his albums. But yeah, I think he's, I, I mean, he could be in a group, but he's a perfect solo artist. I know he can dance, but I think he prefers to just like play the guitar, like sing and play the guitar, and that's totally fine. I would want him to do whatever he prefers. So yeah, look how cute he is. He's so cute in this photo book. This is such a summery vibe to me and I love it. Well, I mean, obviously it was released in the summer. I love his comeback so much. I just love summer comebacks. I can never get enough of them. These feel good summery comebacks just put me in the best mood. Does his sweatshirt say screw you? <laughs> Soon, what? Okay, um, I love this. He's like basking in the sun, but also wanting to not get sunburned. So he has that umbrella out. So cute, he is adorable. Even just watching the music video alone makes me so happy. Seeing him just vibing in it and enjoying himself. I love it. Makes me happy. This photo book is pretty thick. We love it. I also did really enjoy the b-sides on this album. Uh, I don't know if I have a favorite because I really did like them all. I mean, if I see the track list again, I'll, I'll point out one of my favorite songs. But the whole album was really good. So definitely check out his music. I think he's pretty underrated. But as I said, I think he suits being a soloist well. He doesn't really need to be in a, in a group. I also really like this album packaging. He has been switching it up recently. When he first debuted, his first couple albums have all been the same packaging, but I really like this one. The simple book style, I really like. And the pictures in here are so cute. I love the little added text in there as well. That little smiley face tent is so adorable. I'm boring and too serious. <laughs> he has the cutest face. B, that's one of the songs. I hate bees though. I really hate bees. I hate all insects. If not, you can just sway with me. The smiley face balloon reminds me of Beckyun's photo shoot from Delight. He was posing with like the same balloon. Not the exact same one, but same thing. Yeah, oh well. It also looked like it was filmed in like LA or something. I could be wrong. There are the lyrics. I really like Don't Know. I think Don't Know and no, I think Horizon is my favorite. That one might be my favorite. There's the rest of the tracks with the lyrics. That was super cute. And here is his CD. 
it's like green in person, but it looks kind of turquoisey blue on the camera. Okay, so let me take out my random things. There is this right here. I think you're supposed to pop these out, but I'm not going to do that. Yeah, very cute. Looks like this is a lenticular. Hey, it's the same one. No, it's not the same, but it's basically this, but you get one that's not sitting on the album. That's cute. How adorable. I think I still might put this in my binder. Yeah, probably will. Very cute, very cute. And you also get a, oh, he did, I was right. He's been doing this since his debut. Oh my God, it's so cute. Oh, I love this one. He's adorable. I love this. I love it, love it, love it. I don't mind the Polaroid cards if he does selfies. So cute, so cute. All right, so that was that one. Next, we'll go through the four version. Here's the front. Oh, he has a little teddy bear. So cute. That's so cute. I love it. And the spine is blue. It's kind of hard to read the text though. Ooh. I love it. <laughs> Little bears. So let's get into the photo book. Ooh. It's more later in the day, looks like it. The first photo book was like during the day, like midday, and it was nice and bright out. This looks maybe more into the evening. Or I could be wrong. Maybe it's like morning. I don't really know. <laughs> oh, is that a kite? How cute. I'm sorry, my camera is like, the tripod is sitting right up against the little table that I'm unboxing on, so it kind of bumps, I'm sorry. I love how thick these photo books are. Also, when he first debuted, I didn't get both versions for him, I would always only get one version because I, I didn't really see the point in getting more than one. But now I'm like low-key wanting to maybe go back and get the other versions, but I, I probably won't because... I've been trying to downsize my collection, so there's no point in doing that. But it's kind of weird because I have, I'm, I'm starting to buy both versions for him. Ever since his last album, I've been starting to buy both versions. And since I did it last time, I'm like, just do it again this time. Oh my God, that's such a cute photo of him. I love that. His hair looks so nice. Oh, I, I actually really missed him. I really, really enjoy his music. So I was so happy to find out that he was making a comeback. Little beach photos, so cute. I feel like everything he does is so cute. I just smile every time I see him. <laughs> Definitely, if you haven't checked his music out, I highly recommend. It's so feel good. I love feel good music that makes you feel so happy. Pretty much all of his music is like that. It's either like super soothing and soft, or it's like very like happy and feel good. For the most part, he's a really chill dude and an amazing guitarist, an amazing vocalist. And I just love that he can dance as well. I mean, he's the whole package. <laughs> I still have not gotten over his cover of Shootout, Monster X's Shootout. <laughs> he covered that in one of his concerts, I believe. He did it so well. It's like, damn, this guy can do everything. We love it, I'm here for it. And is that a fishbowl? Like, what, what is he doing with that? Everything he does is cute, so it's fine. How adorable is he? I love this photo shoot so much. I'm not even sure which one I like better. I really, really like them both. So, I mean, since I used to only get one version of his, at this point, I'd probably just say, send me a random one because I wouldn't know which one I'd want. I did that actually with his, I think it was his second mini, no, it might've been his third. I don't know, but one of his albums i asked to have it sent at random so because i at the time i wasn't collecting both so i'm like I'm, I'm not sure which one i want so i had it sent to me at random and they sent me the pink one um over the green one yeah okay this bear head thing <laughs> it's like so cute i love it where is he here i'm curious as to where this was filmed. I'm sorry about the camera constantly shaking. Him and his umbrella, it's so cute. I love this photo book. I love like this part right here. 
it matches the whole aesthetic. Oh god, my back is hurting real bad. It's because I'm sitting in a weird position. I'm doing this to myself. His little smile with his eyes closed. We love it. This is definitely different than the first one. He did not have these writings in the first one. Okay, so here are the lyrics again that we've seen already. Okay, and then the CD. Ooh, it's bright blue. It looks much brighter in person, obviously. Okay, and let me grab everything. So we have these little things. Oh, it's the same, maybe? Yeah, I think they are the same. Um, so it is what it is. Um, and then we have the little, this thing, whatever you want to call this. Little bear, how cute, look how cute. <laughs> we love it. So we have that, and then the photo card. We have another cute one. I don't think this is a selfie, but it's still super cute. I love this blue shirt on him. The little blue shirt with the collar, that's super cute. I love that one. I love him so much. Okay, so that was everything. So that was my unboxing of Seun24. I hope you enjoyed and thank you for watching. Bye!